this is the tripod itself it's aluminium tripod it comes with a ball head it came packaged in a box so it got a newer box and then what's even better is it has come in a nice case so it actually comes as part of this case which is a nice strength material and it's got a handle a zip and a rear strap to put in your shoulder which is adjustable so it's a good size my previous tripod's quite a bit bigger in terms of length but the bag's bigger as well so it's hard to use and get portable but with this tripod it gets really tall but it compact size so you can actually use it for traveling or if you're doing like um photography outdoors so this is the camera tripod itself there's a few adjustment knobs on there so it gives you options to actually have it as a camera over your desk to shoot down and that's quite easy there's a button at the bottom which you can adjust so the tripod itself has three legs that's blank that's blank this one is not blank you might see it's got a little logo there and what that logo does it's got a lock and unlock feature so what that means is you actually unscrew it so if you screw it to the side which is unlocked you can actually take one of the legs entirely off and use it as a monopod so because i'm here what i can do is show you how long this goes this is just one leg so you've got three of these legs which will give you extra support when you've got a camera on them and also the extending center arm as well so you can see here if i touch that to the end of the table this is a five foot table and it just stops slightly short but then you've got the center arm which is about two foot as well so you're easily going to get a nice tall perspective on that and i have tried my camera on there i've got a canon 5d mark ii and that's what i use i've tried it with two lenses the 24 to 72.8 which is a fairly heavy lens and that handled it quite well i was able to use it and take photos with it so this again you can easily screw it back onto the tripod if you're not using it as a monopod and how you add the top on there is the actual top of the tripod also unscrews the ball head joint so you can see that that unscrews like that and that's what you would add onto the leg to make it a, a monopod when you put it in the bag you need to make sure this is not up because then it's a bit too tall you want it to actually go down and then it fits into the bag so that's something to keep an eye on the top plate is a good size it's quite like a lengthy size and if i show you it on my actual 5d mark ii you can screw it onto the bottom of the tripod and it's a fairly easy fit so you'll get a good idea of how this will look so that gets fit onto your bottom of your camera so your camera is ready i bring that up and then it's got a nice little spirit level on there as well so if you're on uneven surfaces you can adjust your legs to get a nice level you put your camera on the top of that and you just tighten it so now that is ready to go if i put that there you can use that on its own if you've got another tripod you can use a head separately as well which is a great idea so the legs are really sturdy the center column comes up so if i show you this like that there's a little adjuster here which lets the center arm actually come up so if i adjust that there you see that comes up and then what you can do is on the bottom of here which not many people know you can use this little feature here to extend the leg out even further there's a little button underneath there you can actually press the button and take that entirely out as well which is a great option if you're going to use that separately so if i put that back in i can adjust here and then actually use it like that so now if i show you that oh you can see i think yep yeah. so i just had there so this is a quick look at these knobs because it takes a little figuring out if you adjust you can actually spin it as well so you get the exact spot that you want so if i quickly set this up on this table to give you an idea of how i would use this so there yeah a bit more and you can see how easily the legs come out it's basically a little turn and the legs just come straight down and easy to open easy to package if you're out and about so if i use that there I can put my camera at the end of here so just that and then use this to get the right angle so as that shows there I need to tighten that a little bit more I can do a top-down table shot on this so if I adjust that just like that 
so what you can do is you notice that just slightly bent forward you can actually rotate it so the front leg of the tripod is further there you need to be really careful with this it took me a little figuring out but once you've got it nailed you can actually adjust the legs out as well and there now that's got a more firm stand so you'll see that there and if I've got something here and I'm doing a shoot that camera there is sturdy but it's good that you saw it tilt because that shows you why you need to be able to turn it because if you couldn't some tripods you can't turn if you can't turn them you can't adjust this leg to give it the extra support because it's three legs so there now that's solid and now I can have a top down shot so